morning everyone welcome back to what i ate weight loss wednesday for today's breakfast i am just having a pretty basic breakfast it's just two um, eggs on toast and this is how it looks i can never seem to make eggs look pretty <laughs> so yeah that's what i'm having today for brekkie um i'm going to quickly eat this and then i'm going to go for a little walk to try and find some ricotta cheese because for, to dinner, for dinner tonight I want to make um, like some stuffed chicken with ricotta and last time I was at the shops there was no ricotta so I'm hoping they've stocked some more so yeah I'm going to enjoy my brekkie and get going I've just got home from the shops and I managed to find ricotta so I'm a happy girl I also picked up a what's it called <laughs> a skinny iced coffee uh, and I'll show you what else I picked up so I haven't tried this before and I thought it sounded really nice green tea with coconut this is smooth and sweet organic green tea so I'm very excited to try that as you all know I love coconut so I'm hoping it tastes like the coconut taste is quite prominent <laughs> and then of course I got my ricotta cheese and I got oh, a packet of steamed cauliflower and I also bought the new uh, collective magazine this is my favorite magazine to purchase it is lunchtime and today for lunch I'm having a salad and some soup. Uh, so the salad is just your basic <laughs> like green salad. It's just got mixed greens, some capsicum, cucumber and I put a little bit of this honey Dijon dressing on top. And then I have some salmon. Um, this is just leftovers from last night so i've just warmed that up a little bit and i'll just pop it on top and then for the soup i am having some minestrone soup it's 99 percent fat free and contains 38 calories per serve and that is the nutritional information it does have quite a bit of sodium in it but i'm not too concerned about that so i'll pop my salmon there's a fly in here that's really bugging me it's I don't know how I'm going to do this with one hand. Hang on, I'll put the camera down. So that's how my salad looks and that's how the soup is looking. It is snack time and I'm actually pretty excited about my little snack that I've got going on in front of me today. <laughs> so over here I have got an apple that I've sprinkled with some cinnamon and then I have one of these little Special K biscuit moments which looks very nice and i've also made myself one of these um green tea coconut teas that i brought earlier this morning and you'll be happy to know that the coconut flavor is definitely in there this tastes amazing i would probably even go as far to say it's one of my favorite green teas and it's green tea guys so that means um it's good for you <laughs> And I am currently just going through this big pile of magazines. I'm a little bit of a magazine hoarder. I don't know how it happens, but all of a sudden I'll like miraculously have about 50 magazines in my cupboard. So before I put them in the recycle bin, I just like to go through them one last time and like tear out recipes that I want to try or like yeah like this thing in here I didn't even realize was in there so I'm going to take that out it's a little freebie <laughs> some of you wanted me to do like a little life update um so my life my current life update is I'm still in Brisbane and I do like it here I just really really miss my family and friends if my family and friends were here it would be perfect <laughs> i think also because in perth i had a customer service job so i was constantly like with customers and like constantly just interacting with people and now here in brisbane i am not working and i'm at home most of the day so i think 
I don't really feel lonely. I just, yeah, I think I'm missing that interaction with people a little, little bit. But that's my own fault. Like, I think I need to get out a little more and, like, make new friends. I just find it hard to make friends. Most people would think because I make YouTube videos, like, I'd be super outgoing and um, find it easy to make friends. But that's a totally opposite to me. Like, I'm a very, very shy person. Um, and I do find it hard to make new friends. So, yeah, I need to get out of my comfort zone and like maybe I don't know I don't know I need to yeah get out of my comfort zone and make some new friends in Brisbane so yeah work wise I am not working at the moment just 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 enjoying having a little break <laughs> which is really weird to say I mean I'm not at home like just doing nothing I am keeping myself busy um, I have actually been working on something that actually I guess I can share it with you all now I've been working on creating a like weight loss planner I've got a little copy in front of me that I guess I can give you a little sneaky peek of so yeah it's just like a little um, wire bound book and it's something that I think would help people with their weight loss so inside we've got like a little menu planner where you can plan your uh, meals for the week and then like a shopping list um, some quotes workout planner and the most important part is um, a food diary where you can write down like what you have for breakfast lunch and dinner and keep track of your water there's quite a few other bits and bobs inside um, but it's not 100% finished yet so I don't want to go into too much detail about it generally not a week will go by where I don't like plan my meals for the whole week um, and I just find by doing that it just keeps me organized and accountable and yeah it just makes my life so much easier when I know ex when I know exactly what I'm going to be eating every day and it also makes grocery shopping a lot easier so I just wanted to create like a little weight loss planner that girls can use to keep them on track with their weight loss journey and yeah but I'll go into more details about it once it's completed uh, so yeah, that's one thing that I've been working on and also my YouTube videos I don't know if any of you have noticed I've been doing a lot more videos. So yeah, I've been keeping myself busy I'm not just sitting at home being bored. <laughs> okay. I am going to drink my tea because I think it's probably getting cold Oh, that's so good If you like coconut and if you like green tea definitely recommend this I got this one at Woolies so Jay wanted to come down to a pub um, after he finished work, so we're at the pub and I'm just having a glass of red wine. Um, and then we'll go home and I'll start cooking dinner. We are home from the pub and I've just got started on making dinner for us. I've never actually made this before so I don't know how it's going to turn out. Um, but what we're having is chicken breast stuffed with some ricotta cheese. So um, in the ricotta cheese I just mixed some of this lightly dried basil and some salt and pepper and yeah just kind of squished it inside the chicken and then on top of the chicken there's just a little bit of paprika salt and pepper and i'm just going to bake these for about half an hour and we are also having some corn um and we're also having some carrot chips that my beautiful husband is cutting up uh, so I'll show you how I make the carrot chips once they're all cut up but it's pretty late it's like I think it's 7 30 so I'm having a bit of a late dinner usually I eat well we eat around 6 6 30 so for the carrot chips I've just uh, put some smoked paprika garlic granules salt and pepper and a little bit of this 
olive oil spray and I'm just going to wrap them up in the foil and they usually take about 20 minutes in the oven. Here is the end result of dinner. So we've got the carrot chips, some corn and this is the chicken breast stuffed with ricotta cheese. It honestly smells amazing, so I'm very, very excited to tuck into this. We have just finished dinner and the chicken was really good. I definitely recommend ricotta cheese and chicken together. Like all the flavors seem to really work well. I'm not going to eat anything else for the rest of the night because dinner was pretty late today. So I'm just going to head to bed. <laughs> I'm going to take my new magazine with me and have a little read of it. But I hope you've all enjoyed my What I Ate Weight Loss Wednesday for today. And I will see you all again next week. <laughs> Bye. Don't forget to click on this little bell here just so you don't miss any of my new video uploads.